You're watching Fox 5 News at 10. What New Yorkers watch. Well, we're told that compact fluorescent light bulbs help you save energy, which helps lower your electric bill. But do those new lights also contain a dangerous chemical? Fox 5's Brett Larson tells us. They're bright, energy efficient, and save money. But do these new compact fluorescent light bulbs, or CFLs, also contain a chemical that can threaten your health? You do have to treat them a little more carefully if they break, and you do have to uh, treat them more carefully when you throw them away. Celia Coopersmith Lehrman is deputy editor with Consumer Reports, talking about the possible dangers of the new green bulbs. Dangers is a pretty strong word. I mean, there really aren't any dangers. The problem? CFL bulbs contain mercury, a heavy metal that has the potential to pose a health threat. CFLs work by um, making gases glow, and it's part of the process of making the gas glow. Seth Bauer is with Green Guide, and he tells us though the lights do contain mercury to help create light, it's less than you might think and less than their incandescent counterpart. If you choose an incandescent bulb, you are indirectly emitting mercury into the atmosphere because the coal-fired power plants actually vaporize and emit mercury. And the science says that they actually emit per light bulb about twice as much from an incandescent going into the atmosphere than is used physically in constructing the CFL. Should you break a bulb, that's where the mercury can create a problem. So there's some simple tips to follow to stay safe. What you need to do when a bulb breaks is you let the room air out for about 15 minutes. Now, if it's on a hard surface, you can use a piece of paper to sweep most of the debris up, and then you throw that out. And then once that's done, you'd want to clean the area with a damp cloth. But if you're on a carpeted surface, what you would do instead is you end up using sticky tape to get up all the different pieces, and then you vacuum. And the more likely threat of mercury exposure to you and the environment is when the bulb burns out. So even if they just burn out, which hopefully they're not going to do for about five years, take it out of the socket and instead of just throwing it in the trash, look for a hazardous waste disposal. Stores like IKEA and some big box electronic stores will take them away for you. And many municipalities have collection centers for the new bulbs, which should never be tossed in the trash. The bottom line is CFLs are not scary. They give off a nice light, they save a heck of a lot of electricity, they are not life-threatening in any way, and they're really the better choice at this point. Now there's a new type of energy efficient bulb, LED light bulbs. They're 90% more efficient than a regular incandescent bulb. They contain no mercury and they last 35 years with regular use. The catch? They cost around 60 bucks. We've got the details on our website, myfoxny.com. I'm Brett Larson. Back to you. Thank you, Brett.